the easiest way to fade an image in Canva is to use the Fade Fader in the Edit Image panel. To use it, click on your image, then go into Edit Image, then under Adjust, click on See All, and then simply move the Fade Fader to the right to fade your image. The second great way to fade an image in Canva is by reducing the transparency of the image. This is also a very easy feat. First of all, click on your picture and then in the upper right corner, click on the transparency symbol and then move the fader to the left to reduce the transparency. There are two great ways left now and you should really watch until the end of this video because I'm pretty sure you never heard about the last method that I'm going to introduce in this video. But before we get to that, let's have a look at the third great method to fade an image in Canva. In this method, we will make use of gradients. Now click on elements in the left toolbar and search for gradients. Now simply choose one of these bigger gradients, I suggest you to use either a square or a rectangle gradient, just like this one here. Click on it to add it to your project. Now enlarge it to make it the same size as your picture. Please note that here you shouldn't do right click and then click on replace background or set as background because then this method won't work. So you should really just insert the picture from the elements tab like that and then just drag the corners to make it the same size. Once you have it in the same size, all that is left for you to do is to click here on the transparency fader in the top right corner of the screen and then reduce the transparency. And just like that we have a great colorful fade. Now let me just give you a pro tip here, in case you like this method but you would actually like to have different colors then you can actually also achieve that because some of these gradients here will let you choose the color. Let me just demonstrate that for a second. First of all I'm going to delete our gradient here and then I'm going to scroll down here in our elements tab and this time we're going to choose this gradient here. And now once again we're going to enlarge that one so that it has the same size as our original picture. Now have a look here next to edit image we actually have these lovely two color squares. And whenever you have that with a gradient or any other Canva element then you know that you can actually customize its color. Here we can customize even two colors because it's a two color gradient which is awesome. So let us quickly customize these colors. I will probably go with a dark blue here. And for the other one I will go with this aqua blue here. And now once again let me reduce the transparency by clicking here in the upper right corner on the transparency symbol and then moving the fader to the left. And this looks absolutely awesome. Now here on the left side you have probably noticed that you also have a section called photo colors which is yet another amazing feature because for every Canva photo Canva will actually automatically show you the exact colors that are used in your photo and will make it very very easy for you to use these colors. So for our lovely gradient here that means that we could also use the very same colors that are actually in our image. So let us just give that a go. So I'm clicking here on our first color and for our first color I will click on that color here under photo colors and then I will click on our second gradient color and for that one I will go with the last one here. And just like that we have a perfectly matching two color gradient to fade our image. Now last but not least I'm also going to reveal this secret method to fade an image in Canva. For this purpose go into the elements tab and this time search for gradients that fade to transparency. We will choose the first one here because this is one of the only ones that is actually available for Canva free users. All of the ones that have a crown symbol in the lower right corner are reserved for Canva pro users. So let us click on that first one here. And now let us enlarge it so that it has the same size as our image. That already looks pretty awesome and this gives our image a really special feel. Maybe the effect is a little bit too heavy for you like this so what you can always do is to click on your gradient and then go into the transparency here and lower the transparency to reduce the effect. Lovely stuff indeed. And also if you paid close attention before in this tutorial you will know by now that you can click on these color squares next here to edit image and you can even change the colors of the gradients. So for instance if that purple is a little bit too crazy for you you can always go in here and just simply choose another color. Just like that. And there you have it guys the four very very best ways to fade images in Canva. Now if you would like to become a pro in Canva I highly suggest you to also watch the next video where I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about video editing in Canva. With that said I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you did please smash that like button, subscribe to my channel and also make sure to hit that notification bell so that when I publish new videos on Canva you will get notified immediately. Have a good one and see you soon in the next video. Bye bye.